Hello, I'm Kate Mayers and I'm a Macmillan Skin Cancer Clinical Nurse Specialist at Kingston Hospital. Being in the sun makes us feel good, but being out in the sunlight without adequate protection puts us at greater risk from skin cancer. In this video, I'm going to tell you how you can stay safe by practicing the five S's of sun safety. Slip on a t-shirt, slop on a Factor 30 plus UVA sunscreen, slap on a wide brimmed hat, slide on some quality sunglasses and shade from the sun wherever possible. Let's look at these in more detail. Densely woven fabrics like denim, canvas or synthetic fibres will give you more protection than sheer or thin fabric which allows harmful UV radiation to get through to your skin. Darker or bright colours offer you more protection because they absorb the UV rays and looser clothes are better than tight-fitting ones. The more skin your outfit covers, the better the protection. Check out clothing companies to see if they do a range of UV protective clothing for holidays or sport. Use sunscreens that offer both UVA and UVB protection. Choose a water resistant sunscreen with a sun protection factor of 30 or higher and a UVA rating of 4 or 5 stars and please check the expiry date. Apply sunscreen 20 minutes before going out and reapply it every two hours once you're outside, especially if you get wet or wipe your skin with a towel. The once a day sunscreens will also need to be reapplied to allow for poor application or rubbing. If you have sensitive skin, use a mineral sunscreen and if you're prone to acne, avoid sunscreen containing oxybenzone and PABA. If you have eczema, your skin can react badly to sunscreens so only use them if your eczema is under control. Never rely on sunscreen alone to protect your skin. The best sunglasses are close fitting and wrap around to stop the sun getting in through the sides. Look for the European CE mark. A high EPF of nine or 10 will provide the best protection. Stay in the shade when the sun is at its strongest. In the UK, that's from 11 a.m. to 3 p.m. from March to October. We strongly discourage the use of sunbeds for cosmetic tanning. Research shows that first exposure to sunbeds before the age of 35 increases the risk of melanoma by 75%. If you're under 18, if you have fair, freckly skin that doesn't tan normally, or if you have a large number of moles, then you should never use a sunbed. Those with a history of skin cancer or with an abnormal sensitivity to the sun, either due to allergies or medication, should also avoid them. The vitamin D we get from sun keeps our bones healthy, but studies have shown that light skins only need around 10 minutes of sun exposure at lunchtime daily, between March and September to get enough vitamin D wearing summer clothes. People with darker skin may need longer to get enough vitamin D, but the link between the sun and cancer is well documented. So please stay safe outdoors by practicing the five S's of sun safety. In another video, we tell you how to examine your skin on a regular basis so that you're aware of any changes and can get any marks or moles inspected as soon as possible.